hello everyone welcome back to my channel this is going to be a daily message pick a card reading okay this is for the collective and this is also a timeless reading for those of you who would like to book a personal reading with me all the info is down below so i got four piles here for today's daily message like i said this is a timeless reading take the bits and pieces that resonate with you and leave the rest for someone else okay we got red jasper we have soda light we have rose quartz and last but not least we have um um the clear quartz sorry about my hands it's ashy but anyway let's get right into this reading let's see what your message is for today's daily thank you so much for all of your likes shares comments and subscribes to my channel i definitely appreciate it let's get right into it okay for those of you who picked the um red jasper let's get into your reading and let's see what your daily message is for today okay so your intuitive message we have decision it's time to make a decision about this relationship we have elusive okay we have um recognition reward for marriott okay we have oh a broken wishbone wish will not be granted what else do we have we got the four of wands we got the seven of swords and we have the page of pentacles interesting okay so right off the back i feel like you could be in some sort of relationship um where somebody is definitely a trickster here i'm getting with the elusive card this is kind of like the magician to me this is somebody who you can't really get a hold of here somebody is very manipulating here okay trying to get away with this or trying to get away with something um this could be regarding money here or finances as well um a lot of you could be receiving a lot of great things for your hard work okay you could be studying something or learning something a new skill working or something like that um but i'm getting you need it's time for you to make some sort of decision about this relationship that you have with somebody it's like this person is very hard to um yeah it's kind of like this is a trickster this is somebody who's very hard to catch up with um you never know like what this person is going to do next okay um so we have broken wishbone a wish will not be granted um be careful about your finances or maybe who you let in your home somebody could definitely be trying to steal or like trying to get away with something doing something very shady very sneaky okay because we got two sneaky cards here um and yeah spirit is saying it's time for you to make a decision about this relationship this could be somebody that you've invited over to your home okay maybe somebody that you may have wanted to be with or something like that but we got wish will not be granted so especially with this person if you're dealing with somebody who's picking up this type of energy very shady sneaky lying you know um <laughs> i feel like this will not yeah you wish with this person or you may be moving with this person or um trying to build something solid it's not <clears throat> this is not going to your wish will not be granted especially with this type of person um i feel like you need to keep an eye on your monies or um yeah I feel like somebody could be stealing or something like that. So we got air energy, uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I really feel like you need to keep an eye on your money, um, your <laughs> your goods, okay, um, your home. Just watch who you invite in your home. I feel like this could be somebody that you have some sort of relationship with. But this is like an in and out type of energy or somebody who is just very manipulating, okay? So that's what I have for you. If this reading resonated with you in any way, like, share, and subscribe. For those of you who picked the soda lights, let's get into your daily message. We have new love, a new love or recommitment to love is developing. We got ruthless. Oh, <laughs> angel, spiritual guidance, protection from harm. So that's really a good thing. All right. We have older woman dealings or relationship with an older woman. So you could be this older woman. Okay. So spirit is saying that um, you are spiritually protected or this older woman is spiritually protected. Um, okay. We got the eight of pentacles. We got the nine of swords. Yeah. We got the devil energy. Whoa. Okay. So new love or recommitment to love is developing. Um, or maybe a recommitment. <clears throat> maybe this is okay. So we got some definitely some ruthless energy here. Like somebody who is very toxic, um, has a lot of bad habits. 
they you know care about n no one but themselves here okay so this could be somebody that you've recently started dating or this could be somebody from your past that wants to reconnect with you i feel like somebody is still having some sort of um toxic energy that could be attached to them um interesting you could be wanting to work out this situation um having a lot of anxieties and worries about this okay so one thing i am getting is you are spiritually protected um and spirit could be protecting you from this devil energy here somebody who is definitely very toxic and wanting to keep you trapped and bound in this situation that you know it's not good for you you could have definitely been trying to work on the situation but i feel like it's not getting anywhere spirit i feel like want you to maybe connect with somebody new okay especially if this is somebody like an old energy this is definitely very toxic okay um yeah you're very you're spiritually guided you're going to be spiritually protected as well um and as far as your finances yeah i feel like as long as you keep working hard and moving forward and, um um because i feel like maybe some of you are in this depressing type of energy um especially being trapped in this type of relationship toxic situation so yeah i feel like spirit is telling you not to try to work on something that's already toxic and move on here you're definitely spiritual spiritually protected and you may feel like you are alone <clears throat> you know what i'm saying but spirit and the angels are definitely watching over you i feel like they are going to send you someone who is brand new okay is what i'm getting interesting we got capricorn earth energy towards virgo capricorn um, air energy, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, could be any sign. If this reading resonated with you in any way, like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you next time. All right, for those of you who put who picked my um, rose quartz, let's get into your reading, your daily message. We got leap of faith. It's safe to make the move you're considering. We got cowardly. <laughs> oh, we got good news. We got Temptation Will Test You. Interesting. Five of Pentacles, Queen of Cups, the Knight of Swords. Somebody who's very clever. Okay. So Spirit is saying that it's safe for you to take the leap, you know, the this leap of faith or whatever you're considering. Okay. Um, we got some good news coming in. Okay, for you. So this could be this uh, Knight of Swords energy could be coming in to help you. Okay, but we also got like two energies like it's kind of like cornering you. I don't know why I'm getting that, but like somebody coming from the back, somebody coming from the front here. Um, we have Temptation Will Touch You here with this Apple card, and we also have the Five of Pentacles. So I feel like somebody in this cowardly energy could be coming forward towards you in need of some sort of financial help. Okay. Um, but you do have good news coming in. I feel somebody's rushing in with some sort of good news or something like that. Um, but with this Queen of Cups, you know, she could easily be persuaded. So try not to let people uh, maybe, you know, uh, kind of get over on you or take advantage of you because of some sort of good news that's coming in for you. Okay, this could be considering your finances as well. You could be wanting to move here. Um, but with this cowardly energy, I feel like somebody could definitely try to test you or get over on you or like, yeah, tempt you in some type of way that, that is not good for you is what I'm getting. Okay. Earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, water energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. We also have air energy, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Okay. Just keep an eye out on your finances here. I feel like somebody definitely could be trying to, um, tempt you in some type of way. Like I said, um, yeah, and maybe wanting to get over on you because I'm definitely getting a very, like a very, um, uh, 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 what is that? What is the word I'm getting um, <laughs> with this Queen of Cups energy? Because you're very open, you're very loving, um, and you know you're very supportive as well. And people may take advantage of of you. Okay, that's what I have for you. If this reading resonated with you in any way, like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Last but not least, for those of you who picked the clear courts, let's get into your message. We have retreat. Time alone or in nature will help you heal and recharge. We got insecure. So a lot of you definitely could be feeling insecure. Okay, it's time for you to, to you know, go within, recharge, heal yourself. Okay, um, gain that confidence that you need. Okay, yeah, to be back on your throne here. Okay, position of authority. 
we have for it's okay muddled unclear thinking so a lot of you could be just all over the place with your thinking it's very um you know yeah we got the star card so it's definitely time for you to heal is what i'm getting okay we got the wheel of fortune so your fortune is definitely changing interesting position of authority this could mean like a family business or a lump sum of money could be coming in for you as well spirit wants you to change your mindset get out of this unclear thinking and um negativity or staying in this low vibrational energy it's time for you to heal yourself okay um, continue to have faith, okay? This is, this talks about having faith and hope, okay? Staying optimistic, healing, um, having hope for the future here. We do have the will of fortune. So you're, something is about to change, okay, when it comes to your money, your finances, or your home, okay? I'm getting this throne position. So you could be the head of the household or something like that. Could be a change for your finances is definitely coming in um, where it's going to put you on a on your, you know, throne, beautiful energy but it's time for you to spend some time alone to recharge and heal and get out of this insecure and negative uh vibe here is what i'm getting okay um earth energy towards virgo capricorn we got um aquarius okay it could be any sign here but i'm definitely getting you could definitely be in this um depressing energy where spirit is telling you it's time for you to heal um, pick yourself up and get yourself together. So, because it's kind of like you could be blocking, um, you could be blocking your blessings here, staying in this, you know, not so good energy. Okay. So yeah, spirit definitely wants you to get out of this unclear thinking. Heal. Um, spend some time alone. Meditate. Okay. Ground yourself. Um, that's definitely what I'm getting. Yeah. So if this reading resonated with you in any way, like, share, and subscribe. Definitely your finances are about to change here with this Wheel of Fortune, major shift, good fortune, okay? And with the Ten of Pentacles, this talks about family, maybe a lump sum of money, okay? Um, a new job coming in for you is something that's going to put you in a position of authority, and it's going to definitely help you, okay, um, when it comes to your family, your financial state as well, okay? So that's what I have for you. If this reading resonated with you in any way, like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye.